Hi everyone, welcome to Simply Amazing Life and today I am giving you the kitchen tour and uh, here I will show you what all I have done to organize and uh, keep everything in place as far as tidy as possible in this tiny kitchen. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video and also hit that bell icon to keep you posted for the new video updates. So I am dividing the kitchen in two parts. One is the hob side and the other is the sink side. So on this side, the very end of the wall has a four burner hob and a chimney. I keep this area absolutely clean and clutter free. Uh, on the handles, I have these uh, kitchen towels. They are from home center and also I keep a bottle or a jug of water. This really helps me while cooking. These uh, kitchen towels are really good quality and I think they came in set of six. They are highly absorbent and right near the uh, hob I have this uh, paper towel dispenser and uh, I have put two parchment papers, one brown and one plain ones. Right under the hob, there is a space which I have utilized to keep extra hand towels, some foil papers. Now these foil papers are like a jumbo size, extra brown parchment paper as I do a lot of baking. I also keep this uh, big towel to dry all my washed vegetables and I store all the washed vegetables in these net bags. Then some mittens and all the kitchen cloth are stored in this basket. I have lined all the shelves with shelf liners. Now right under that cabinet is a huge cabinet drawer. And it is a heavy duty one where I store all my grains like rice, whole wheat flour, gluten free flour, bulk supply of sugar. Now this is the window that's there in the kitchen and this is where I shoot all my uh, videos. It has a decent amount of light coming in the kitchen and also has an amazing view to it. Right under this, I have the cutlery drawer where I store all the cutleries, knives and uh, small little uh, utilities that I need for the co cooking like lemon squeezer, garlic press, scissors, specially used only for the kitchen work. I also have these IKEA clips. They come really handy. In the drawer next, I have all my everyday dishes. Now these are my all plates and cups that I use on everyday basis and few mixing bowls. These plates are of really good quality and they are from the company Tero and I have been using it for more than a decade now. So you can understand that how good quality they are. It came in set of seven. Now I still own almost five of them. And this is where I store all my cooking utensils. Uh, pots and pans are all stacked. Because I do not have a lot of space. So there is the this is the only best option. But I have stored all the lids in this uh, basket. And there is one stainless steel pressure cooker. Right next to this, I have another cabinet where I store all the trays for easy access because I need it every now and then. And on inside, there are extra utens cooking utensils, which I don't use every day, but I still need to keep it when I'm cooking for a party or any uh, bigger gatherings. 
so right here i store big packets of grains like bulk of rice whole wheat murmure and also some some cleaning wipes here in this dispenser now this is my spice cabinet it's a tall unit or i don't know this is kind of a drawer system here now the i have lot of spices <laughs> um and over the period as you can see i had to add extra bottles and uh, the only solution for me was to label everything to remember what all spices i have the bulk supply is stored in a all in deep freezer but uh, all the powders and everything that i make i store in these small little containers right next to the spice cabinet is another cabinet and this i specially made for uh, ishi because she enjoys baking a lot so i got these uh, pull out handle baskets where all her baking supplies have been stored her cookie trays and then all baking tins piping bags mixing bowls they are all for her to access uh, very conveniently now right here is all my uh, glassware where i do all meal prep and store them again all the lids are stored in the basket now the counter top i do not have lot of decor per se because i do not have a counter uh, lot of counter space so i have chosen for decor pieces which are functional so this was from uh, the company called elementary it was quite a splurge i tell you but uh, it looks really beautiful and it's really good quality now another was this uh, utensil holder that i made out of a wine chiller and these all uh, utensils are of great quality and i have shared it in my amazon uh, must have video so you should check that out i'll link that uh, video in the description box for you guys and all i did was i took some acrylic paint and i wrote utensils on it and it looks really good on the counter and right next to this i have all my oil bottles i use different type of oil uh, during cooking and uh, i have these bottles the first uh, yellow cap bottles was an amazon purchase but that was not of a great quality the other two i bought it from home center and these are the pots where i store salt sugar and ghee and this stand is uh, from home center this uh, this is actually a tier plate stand and this is a honey bottle again an amazon find and right under this there was space so i pushed in my masala box in there and this is again a shisham box wood box masala box that's like staple in every indian kitchen and right on top of this i have the snacks cabinet and on top of that i store my uh, teapot set which i don't use very frequently and here is all the snacks i have not labeled them though i have the stickers on them but i haven't because i keep changing the snacks so maybe i can write snacks only on this i mean what else should i do i don't know right next to this cabinet is uh, this cabinet where i store all my staples all the dals lentils then a uh, gram flour murmure flat rice pastas and most of them are stored here that i use on everyday basis and uh, some of the essentials like salt and turmeric which is in a bulk amount also is stored here i get peanuts in bulk amount that also is stored here so kind of now initially i got those purple ones uh, when amazon was just launched in india yes and then later on i got these uh, bottles they are not that great quality i can tell you that but they work fine and the on the other side is my dishwasher and sink now this is a rental uh, kitchen so i cannot transform this place and right on top of the dishwasher is my decade old 
LG convection microwave and it is such a worth purchase I can assure you this was a home for my lots and lots of baking experiments and uh, it has tolerated me throughout these years and right on top of my uh, lovely microwave oven is uh, my miscellaneous cabinet I would say in this cabinet I hold all the tissue papers and kitchen towels and all the disposable cutleries the blue lid box that you see it has all the spoons the big white box that you see holds all the bowls so these are all disposable cutleries and stuff that is kept there and this is my tea coffee station or milk station and it has a kettle and few cups and some of the tea coffee essentials like coffee green tea black tea then some marshmallows also we have some flaxseed so all the things that we need to prepare we have sugar we have milk powder some of the nuts that we take in the morning then we also have some tea blend here this works perfectly and this is one of the shelf that gets used the most this uh, multi-purpose kettle we have kept because sometimes Anshuman and Ishi likes to make uh, their soup or maggi or pasta in it and right under this I stored three bottle of water actually there were four one just got broken during the transfers so now I'm left with three and they work perfectly because it comes with a handle supposedly it's a milk bottle but I used to store it for water and right on top of this is my uh, all my glassware cabinet you can say so so all my glassware like wine glasses beer glasses whiskey glasses short glasses the basket on the top has all my short glasses they are all different types instead of shorts I serve all desserts in it we are not too much on hard drinks and uh, so but I just love collecting all these stemwares I I make all different kinds of mocktails and uh, enjoy them I also kept some of the drinking glasses as it is really close to the uh, water filter so it made more sense to hold all the glasses right next to the water filter and right below this is my store uh, kind of a pantry stuff where I keep the major bulk item everything all my dals and all the packaged stuff which is not been opened gets stored here it also holds all my mixer grinder then my immersion blender so this basket holds all of them properly in place this is a bulk stock of oats now in this in this uh, bas basket or box i keep all the snacks which are open and cannot be stored now this is a recent purchase from amazon and oh my god this is so good and such a good quality it's a must buy it's a must buy so uh, this is all about the cabinet and uh, all apart from this i'll give you a separate tour of entire pantry how i've stored the label always works any labeling of all the containers always always works so this is the sink area and uh, only thing that i hate about this is those wires i mean one is for the dishwasher one is for the microwave but I can't help it it's a rented kitchen so I cannot break and do anything about it if you have some idea please do share now in this tray I hold uh, all my uh, cleaning dish cleaning soap hand cleaning soap then I also have a bowl with a scrub and sponge this uh, 
dispenser the soap dispenser is a diy i kind of painted it with uh, white spray paint now in this uh, box i hold two toothbrushes one uh, nozzle cleaner and a bottle cleaner the toothbrushes are of for different purpose one is for the sink and one is for the utensils right on top of the sink i have my aro fitted and the geyser we have not done much uh, any kind of storage or anything like that because our own needs a uh, frequent maintenance and filter changing and cleaning so just added two command hooks to hold the bottle brush and the wiper now this is uh, the old utensil holder or cutlery holder now it is no more in use so i have used it as my catch all Uh, you know vegetable peels or everything and then i take it out and then discard it in the dustbin right next to this is where i store all my plates and uh, soup bowls pasta bowls now this is a 12 plate setting from uh, amazon basics and the soup bowls that you see along with those white plates are from uh, home center these are of very good quality i am super impressed and these pasta bowls again are from amazon and right on top of this i have my kettle and some other knickknacks like travel mugs and stuff like that under the sink i have tried and utilize the best of my abilities <laughs> it's a space very cramped space and there are so many things to store here so mostly it's all cleaning supplies and uh, i have used a basket and also i have used uh, these drawer shelf like thing now in this basket i hold all my cleaning supplies which i purchase it in bulk uh, like colin then hand soap detergent the toilet bowl cleaners which has not been opened mosquito spray and also a bottle of floor cleaner in this this is a bucket that i use every day for the cleaning this bucket holds uh, the floor bleach then uh, floor cleaner sif bottle and this is a concoction that i made specially to clean the washrooms This is a old container where I store all the garbage bags. This is the rinse aid that I need for my dishwasher. This is a Collins spray or all-purpose uh, cleaner. Now this is my old toothbrush holder and I am using it. I've spray painted it and I'm using it to hold all my cleaning supplies like lint roller and stuff like that. that brown bottle holded all my naphthalene balls this is an i old ice cream box where i am storing all the tea lights so i have tried and used whatever i had on hand already and uh, i keep all my essential oils here because i light candle every single day and uh, i also light aroma lamps every single day now the bottom shelf of this holds all the detergent for the dishwasher and this is the old uh, box my daughter used to have uh, the milk mixes long time back and in this these are pretty sturdy boxes so i am storing all my drainex the gloves extra sponge some bleach so all these things are stored properly here in separate pouches so one can easily access this now this is my microfiber duster which i use to clean all my windows and doors all these glass doors this works so perfectly so this is this side so this is how i have organized the under the sink area we also have this folding stool tucked away in between dishwasher and the cabinet this uh, rug is from 
Amazon and it comes really handy and it's super easy to clean so I hope you enjoyed the tour of my kitchen if you did then please please don't forget to like and share this video with your friends and family and do hit that bell icon to keep you posted for the